Today um, we might be different because today is a very special day. So I'll give an honorable mention to my sister because she's the one who helped me get to this and make video of, it, of games. Now I can make videos of get some games. So now what I'll be able to do is I can make some games and then we will get more videos every single day. So it's just the first game I could find. So it's this game. And it's called Plug It Out 2. So it's the game, it's the type of game where what you do, you have a bunch of slugs and you get them ready and then you battle other people. That's basically it. But they're not real and they're all fake. So I will get my team ready and battle. The very first guy you get in the whole game is this guy. This guy right here in furnace, he's the very first guy you get and one of the strongest in the whole game. His damage is really strong. And okay, and then I can use my Z. And what he does is he basically like a, he's like a double attack. Any of his forms will destroy, like there's three forms, there's level one, level two, and level three. I will show when I'm in the game, so I'm gonna get this deck ready with my breaker and yeah, how strong is it now? What should we get? If you guys have any ideas for any slugs, leave a comment down below. I want to get this deck ready. Uh, with, you know what? Why not? Bubblone. So the names of all of them. Uh, right here, read these, and there are some guys that I have not unlocked yet. They are really hard to get. I have unlocked. There is, there's some types of call like Arachnet. He is a ghoul slug. Ghoul slugs are their own slugs, but they're evil. But they're good for us. And these are new ones that are called elemental. And there are also some good elementals which are really, really strong. They are almost impossible to beat. I've never watched one, but they are really hard. My strong one is Zed, strongest. He's a three star and he's really good. So let's get into a battle. I've showed everything I have. So leave a comment down below for any decks. Let's do it. So as you guys can see, it's like these things. What you do is you move these around and you get power up for your slugs. And your slugs get stronger. And every time they get stronger, they will do more damage to the opponent. Like this guy right here, my Z will use his power, destroy the other slug and still attack. Different slugs have different power ups. So most slugs like have really different power ups. Some can have same like bubble, the bubble guy. What he will do is he will knock the opponent's slug right back at them and make them attack themselves. Zed stops the other slugs and Infernus will do a lot of damage. But the Maw Breaker he has a surprise. So as soon as I get him, you shall watch. <laughs> I have already completed the storyline of the whole game, but I can still go to the whole storyline except the bosses part. But the bosses were actually easier than the actual storyline, so we can actually make it the we can do the storyline except the bosses. So we will get to that maybe in this video or some other video. And I will be making videos every day or almost every single day. I will not I will not be able to make a video tomorrow because I am going somewhere. But Catch you some other time after this video. Marbreaker, the Marbreaker guy is almost ready. I've taken all the damage, but I'm not losing, not even close. Because when you play the game, you damage not that much damage is actually good sometimes. Um, sometimes it's not good to always stop the slugs, but sometimes it is good because depending on the slug strength. And now my mom is almost ready and 
my mom wake up and go now. What he does is eat the other slugs, but for, but then this guy use his ghoul. He uses his ghoul, uh, ghoul healing guy. He's called Med Doc. Yeah, so he's ready again. I'll teach him as frequently as possible because then he's a slow damage, but he will do a lot of damage slowly. We have taken a ton of damage. Now this is when it seems like I'm in trouble. But when I ask you the truth is I'm not. Ha! And there's also some chance of getting critical attacks. So critical attacks will basically double the damage that you do. So now I am just gonna see what he does. It's better to just try to fill up everything that you have and then it has which will make you be able to fight easier because then when they use something really strong you can counter it with your strong thing too i will wait i don't need to attack that because that is a very weak one this guy's okay but still pretty weak the ice guy is another type of shield guy he is able to stop all the other slugs but it's just hard so I'll just use my bubblegum guy and he I reflected that guy back at him right now. And it was the same in furnace dude, but level is really matter. I'm only level 15 and she's on level 6. That's why mine was way stronger than his one. Okay. If I don't talk for a while, it means I'm just really concentrating in the game. Death. Whoa, this never usually happens. I never die. Should I? Oh no, add, 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 add. No, adverbs, adverbs, adverbs. I don't like ads. No one likes them. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye, ad. Goodbye. Thank you. Come on, load! Thank you. Okay. I am here. And when you win battles, you unlock chests. And you get your slugs from chests. As you can see, I have tons of slugs. Which means I have won tons of, tons of chests. I'll just put... I'll put this one unlock. Okay. Now, I'm going to go to the shop. No, I'm not going to watch for 10 gen. It shows every single time. They have said that the elementals will leave, but they never left. I've played this for months and they have not left. So, and you can also buy food, which levels your guys up. Okay, I'm gonna go to the chests. I will save up. So guys, tell me in the comments down below, which one do you want, want me to save up for? The legendary chest? or the dark chest okay so tell me any chest that you want gold silver premium quick power up dark or legendary okay so then now but also you can play around with these slugs here I like to hit them up i like to hit them in the head with the walls Oh, also, I'm gonna use someone else today, right now. Enigma instead of the bubble. So, the special thing about Enigma is what he does, he gives our slugs power while we go. And as we play through, I will give one tricks and ways to win. And so some slugs take power away from you. So what the best thing to do is at that time, 
like this guy right here uh oh no go okay so what that that guy would have done he would take him power away from us and if he does hit then what you want to do is you want to use his lugs as much as fast as you can every single one so he takes away the least power away from you and then you are also able to do as much damage as possible because they would basically minimize your damage to the bare bare minimum 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 okay uh um no z will go on we have almost got it why do you keep losing this I hate this guy i'll risk it i'll risk it it was a weak one It was full. But... Okay, I'm gonna go into focus mode. Some other time we will get a face cam. Everyone out, everyone out. Oh no. What just happened to me today? I'm not playing dog well. Yeah, still gotta do something, guys. Keep your Z ready when you have it. <laughs> what I have. <laughs> no, no, no. Everything out again. Maybe hey, almost one. Boom. That should be a win. No, I hate it. Oh, one more thing. The computer guys always there until the slugs are obviously the end. So if they're not nowhere even close to build up, you're safe and you win the battle if they're if you're at the end. GG no we So guys that'll be it for this video and I will do the play two I'll start next next time. Oh, I hate ads. I will make another video next time. So, catch you on the flip side. Flip side. Badoom. See ya.